The despised Exynos 2400 appears to have outperformed the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 in several tests. Remember that these two processors are present in the Galaxy S24 series. In the case of the Exynos processor, it is present in Galaxy S24 and S24 Plus in the vast majority of countries, while the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 is mainly in the Galaxy S24 Ultra, but it is also present in the United States, China, and some other countries in the smaller siblings. Of course, this has caused the annoyance of many because Exynos processors do not usually have a very good reputation, but it seems that this year Samsung has decided to improve substantially in the power of this processor. The first comparisons are already circulating on various YouTube channels, and in this case a channel called NL Tech did a test with different video games for cell phones and definitely surprising the performance achieved by the Exynos processor. In Henshin Impact, both processors are able to maintain a smooth execution at 60 frames per second. He also did the test on PUBG and again we see consistent performance at 90 frames per second on the configuration that was compatible and on the other configuration it was also practically stable at 60 frames per second. On the other hand, in PUBG New State also reached 90 frames per second both chips, although specifically in Call of Duty if we see that the Snapdragon processor has a superior performance reaching 120. 20 frames per second even with super resolution mode enabled while the Exynos processor stays at 60 frames per second. Although in this case the difference is basically due to lack of compatibility not necessarily a lack of power then we would have to wait for several developers to also adapt all their content for this new chip but in the game called War Thunder is where the Exynos excelled. This game has ray tracing enabled and therefore the Exynos processor managed to be around 100 frames per second while the Snapdragon processor quickly limited itself to 40 frames per second in some urban areas, showing that they would give priority to the chip not getting so hot. However, the Exynos processor did manage to maintain smooth performance for longer. It looks like the time has finally come and Exynos would be outperforming Snapdragon specifically in some games.